I uh, say I straddle many different facets of the PPPs that we talked about. And in summary, I like to say that I'm an investment maker by training, an international development practitioner by passion, and a tech startup founder by necessity. And in short, I build sustainable uh, business models, not just for the ventures and the SMEs themselves, but also the incubating and accelerating ecosystems that's needed to help them grow. And with that, we need the PPPs. And with, from our insight, um, what I like to share is the three takeaways that, the most important takeaways that we've gotten from our work um, with all these multi-stakeholders. And to build uh, private-public partnerships, we need to understand the how. And from our insights, we've learned there's three Ps that actually um, are very important. First of all, it's to understand the purpose when we're talking about partnerships, because within each partnership, there's different stakeholders that have different definitions of what their ROI is. What is their return on investment? You know, is it the um, is it profitability? Is it growth? Is it impact? So we need to understand all the mutual definitions to make sure everyone is on the same page and that the program is beneficial for everybody. Second is participation, and that includes the people, the capacity building, and understanding how do we incentivize and build the structures necessary to actually engage uh, and con uh, ongoing participation much uh, further than what an initial pilot would be able to do. And the third is building the pipeline. The pipeline is super important for sustainability because we've heard over the, the past couple days why it's so crucial for us to develop solutions to go beyond the pilot because there's so many pilots that start and stop. So in order to do that, we need to understand the pipeline in terms of market, in terms of access, and that ongoing business model that is sustainable so we can actually carry this forward. Thank you.